Hi, I'm Amelie with Systematic Excellence Consulting, and today I'm going to go over ClickUp Notes and some different recommendations for how to take notes um, in ClickUp. So, uh, one of the ways I'm going to, well, one of the examples I'm going to use is with meetings. Um, so, when we're having meetings, obviously there are some notes that need to be taken. So, what I did is I set up a list here inside of operations. I did break it down in a couple of different ways. So if you haven't watched my video on lists yet, I highly recommend you go and do that. Um, and the hierarchy, the video on hierarchy to, um, if you haven't watched that yet, it will be helpful to understand some of the terminology. So just really quickly, this is a space. These are lists. I don't have a folder here, but you can have a folder. Um, and I broke it down. So let's say you wanted to have different lists for your different meetings or recurring items, you could do that. But let's say you just wanted one for meetings to track all your meetings. Um, so let's say um, in your meetings area, you might want to have a meeting that isn't scheduled, but you know coming up um, you want to have a meeting to, I don't know, like something, um, review blog posts for lead magnets, right? But it's not scheduled yet. You just don't want to forget that you want to do that. But your scheduled meetings are your weekly, your monthly, your quarterly, your annual planning. So um, inside of the task, you can create documents to take notes. So I did this as an example. So if we have a weekly recurring meeting every Tuesday morning, maybe we take notes inside of a document. Um, and so you have your items inside of here. You can take notes. Um, you can even turn these into a task. So I just gave this as an example. Let's say it's a new task and we want to put it in the, um, maybe we want to put in marketing, um, marketing, or let's just put in personal items for now. Okay. And then I can assign it to myself. I can put a due date on it. Let's say we want to make it due for today. Okay, cool. So now, um, this becomes a task. Um, and it's in the, the open status. You can change the status in here if you want, it'll open the task up. Okay. Anyway, I don't want to get too far into that cause that's not the point of the video. <laughs> so anyway, you can take your notes here. Oh, I just clicked on the task again. <laughs> okay. So you take your notes here. Now you can embed, um, pages. So if you wanted to keep all of your weekly notes in the same document, you could create weekly team meeting, um, what, 615, like you could keep it here, take your notes there. Um, and you could just rename this to just be weekly team meeting notes. Or, um, what you could do is inside that task, you can create a new document. So let's say we wanted to have separate documents. Maybe that's, you just prefer to see it that way. So now it's going to open up the new doc and let's say that this is for this week. So weekly team meeting um, 15 and then I can take my notes right here. Um, and this is a lot like a Google doc or a word doc or something like that. You can link it to tasks or another doc. If you needed to do that, you can, you can share this, you can um, comment on it. So you can have a lot of back and forth on a document. Um, so maybe um, another example I'm going to show you is like with a client, like if you're doing a planning session with a client, you could use this as a way for you both to look at it a lot like a Google doc where you can be on it. You both can collaborate on it. You can do the same here and um, you can leave comments and things like that. You can assign the comments to people. Um, so that's another way to take notes. Um, and again, you can create the, um, the tasks right inside of there. So if you don't want it to live inside of a task, that's totally fine too. You can, um, come over here to the docs area. If I just go to all docs, now I can see all of my docs and I can see where each of them is located, right? So my like SOP is not associated. It's just associated with everything. Um, and then each of these has their own location, but let's say, um, you want to just have like a brain dump area, right? And, and you just want notes and you just want to take notes and, and have that. Um, but maybe this is something that, um, you 
do daily. So then you can associate it with a task. So if I go to the personal items, uh, maybe it's personal operations, you can, you can link it to that. So then it's related to that. But then again, you can still take notes on it and, and then it'll be linked to it. Um, the same thing with a client. You know, if you have a client, so if I go back to my spaces here and let's say client A, um, and we, maybe we want a um, client meeting <clears throat> um, list. Here we go. Then inside of here, um, you know, maybe we have the um, meeting and just put the date. So maybe the date is the 615. Um, and you can take notes in the description, or again, you can create a document in here to take notes on, and then you can even comment back and forth, or they can come in and actually work on the document together. If you're doing a strategy session, like this would be fantastic because they'll be able to look at it, um, as you're working on it or coming up with a strategy or something like that. So that's, notes inside of um, ClickUp. The one last thing that I use for notes is the notepad um, that I find to be really helpful. Um, and you can do a lot inside of here as well. Um, you can create tasks for items in the notepad. And where I get that is just this little icon down in the right hand corner. Um, and you can take lots of notes. A lot of times if I'm working on a client project, um, I will use the notes to like paste links in that I need. Uh, if I'm doing like, um, I don't know, something that I, I'm going to need to copy and paste some things, I'll just leave it in the notes. And so then I don't have to switch screens because I have the Chrome extension. I get this pop-up down at, or not the pop-up, but the icon down at the bottom on, on all my pages um, when I'm in my browser. Um, so that's notes inside of ClickUp. I hope that that was helpful. Again, I am Amelie with Systematic Excellence Consulting. If you're looking for um, additional support, getting things set up in ClickUp, figuring out the best way to use it, there's a link below that you can book a free call and we can figure out if, if, I'm, if I'm able to support you. So thank you so much for watching.